So this is Newton's first law experiment, and I'm going to point you to all the features of the experiment. We're going to start down this end, where we have a pulley, and on the end of the pulley is a mass hanger, and that mass hanger is connected by a string all the way up to the trolley. And the trolley has on it a number of masses, and also just here we have the light gate. Now the light gate is a device that's going to interact with these two parts of the double interrupt card. If you look closely, as the trolley passes through the light gate, it blocks off the light once and then twice. And that enables the laptop, which is connected to this cable, to then measure the acceleration. So what we're going to do is we're going to accelerate the trolley using the mass, the force from the mass falling and record results. So this is how the method runs. I make sure first of all that my laptop is set up correctly and when that's ready I hold the trolley and I simply allow the mass falling to accelerate the trolley and that is one result. Now we always repeat results so I then do another repeat and another repeat. Now I'll check those three results to see if they're all, all similar amounts. If one of the results looks like it's an anomalous result, then you can repeat that result. Or you can take more than three results if you wish. After you've taken your one set of results, you then increase the force that's pulling by taking one of the masses from the trolley and place that onto the mass hanger. So now the mass hanger has got an extra 10 grams of mass, so it's going to be pulling with a greater force. The important thing to realize is that the hanger, the string, and the trolley are effectively all one object. So the total mass of the system is constant. All I'm doing is I am increasing the force on the trolley. So once I've done that, I'm going to repeat the experiment again. Make sure the uh, data dogger is ready and allow it to pull through. Bring it back around the light gate. Second result. Third result. And then don't forget to check that your three results are similar. And then we continue the experiment by increasing the mass further and further. And three results. And then we keep continuing all the while transferring masses one at a time to the mass hanger to increase the force on the trolley. So this is the experimental method for Newton's second law where we are changing the size of the pulling force whilst maintaining a constant mass of the system.